Hello, hello, and welcome once again to our channel. This is Crypto Bounty. So this video is specific to a subscriber who is having issue with linking it is or a Solana wallet address. So do not specific, but I guess. It is as regards this tab swap unable to link mm -hmm. your Solana wallet address. So it's very simple. Once you come here, click it, and then you are going to see start mission. So when you click start mission, you are going to see go. Click go. Once you click go, it will bring you to the browser so specifically i think you should use um solana that is phantom wallet extension once it opens up this way it may give you some difficulty so come here touch these three dotted lines these three dots open in the browser it that means i think you should make misses or key with your default browser should in case you don't know how to set a particular browser to be your default browser this is how you do it simply drag down your android phone just go through settings click setting the setting icon and then depending on your phone just look for wherever you have apps look at this apps touch it and then you are going to see what is called default apps which is this touch it once you touch it you are going to see browsers touch browsers so whatever browser you want to be your default browser just select it and that is it it becomes your default browser if it's kiwi and so on so i am using missus so this is how you select any browser to be your default browser so just click that open in missus browser or whatever is your default browser so it's going to open up this interface for you when you open up this interface you are going to click select but before you do that ensure that you have installed the phantom wallet extension so there's always already a video on how to install extensions in our browser so the link to that video will be here so this is me if you are using Mrs. it's very simple when you open just open a new tab entirely when you open a new tab entirely you are going to see all the different options you see the extensions touch extensions once it opens up scroll scroll up scroll up then under solana you are going to see phantom this is phantom wallet click it and then it's going to take you to the Chrome Web Store, just the way we did the, <coughs> the way we installed that wallet extension. So zoom it a little, and you're going to see this add to Chrome. It's because I've added it already here that you're seeing that add it to Chrome. So once you add it to Chrome, then come back to this icon, touch it. Once you touch it, you're going to see your Phantom Wallet now click it then once you install it you can follow the previous video i made on how to install extensions and set up your wallet do exactly that and then you are asked to sign in with your password so once you sign in you have this interface before you then you can zoom it a bit so that you can see what we are doing then come this way look at this this three horizontal lines touch it and then you can choose to create so i want to create a new wallet as an example so scroll down scroll down then you see this plus icon touch it and then you click this create new account then you can name it so I'm naming it tap swap two. Okay, I think I created one for tap swap before. Tap swap two. Okay, this is it. So after that, I'm going to scroll down and click create wallet. So once I create wallet, it will automatically switch to that wallet. So this is my tap swap 
wallet I've created. Then I will go back to the tab, which is this tab swap. Now I will now click select wallet. So you can see it now. You can see phantom detected. You click the phantom. Once you click it, it will now open up the phantom extension in your Mrs. browser. A light to load. Then you can see it's asking me to connect tab swap to to it. Yes, I'll click connect. And you see then it will ask me to sign sign message. So I'll click sign. It will open me of the extension again and I will click confirm and then you see it has been done so I can choose to change the address or to disconnect it so immediately I finish look at back to mine back to mine look at it so I click it so it's taking me back to my Telegram account again. So it brings me back to my Telegram account. Then I will then click check. And then you can see done. So this mission is completed. So it's as simple as that. So I can now claim my 100 coins reward. So if I come back, you can see that this mission has been done. So then this is the best way you can connect your Solana wallet. Use the browser extension. So if you download the normal Phantom wallet or Sofle, it's going to be difficult for you to connect. To connect. Then the only thing you can do, if you always prefer using um, the apps, like the phantom wallet like you prefer the app you can you can do that in your browser extension then import with the private key import it to your phantom wallet the app so that you can have access to it both on your phantom wallet in the in the app and in the browser extension okay let me show you how you can do that okay this is how you can do that come here touch the extension icon touch phantom okay i think there will be no need to sign in again because it's still open so it will not ask for password if it asks for password put your password now what you have to do now is to import this we can choose to import this wallet back to the main app so click the three horizontal lines again once you click it scroll down and you are going to see you are going to see this setting icon the third icon let's scroll down like this touch it and then you are going to see manage account so i have about 13 accounts here but this is the main one the tab swap at the top so i'll touch this arrow okay let me keep zooming so i'll tap this arrow once i tap the arrow the information about this particular account will open up then see you can see show secret phrase and show private key so I will choose show private key now it will always tell you to keep your private key very safe then to ask you for your login password so once you put your login password you click next okay before you click next look at this option I will not share my private key with anyone including phantom yet Tick this once you tick it then click next once you click next your private key will be made available for the different blockchains we have solana we have ethereum and we have polygon so i'm just going to pause it now and copy my solana solana private key so once i copy my solana private key 
I've come back to my phantom wallet. You can see my phantom wallet now. Then the main app, not the extension now. So I'll click this account. Once I click it, then I can choose add or connect wallet. And then I will ask, how do I want to add? I'll say import private key. Then I can name, okay, Solana blockchain. Let me leave it in Solana. And then what is the name? Give it the same name, tap swap to. The same name you gave it there so that you can know it's the same. Then you paste your private key. Okay. After pasting your private key, simply click import. And voila, you can see it. It returned to the account now. Your tab swap tool has been imported to your Solana Phantom wallet. So you can now decide if anything happens, for instance, tomorrow when it's time for withdrawal and you have to use your connected wallet. So you can access whatever you have to get through your normal Solana Phantom wallet. So this how to go about it. I hope this addresses or is able to address the issue you have. Please, if it does, let me know in the comment section. And if it does not, let me also know so that you can be specific what exactly it is that you are looking for. Then I know how to go about it. To so come again your way next time, remain blessed. We remain your crypto bounty. Please do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell icon and also share this video so that others can find value in it.